I've been losing friends and finding peace Honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me Look, don't invite me over if you throw another pretty party Looking back, it's hard to tell you where I started I don't know who love me, but I know that it ain't everybody I can never love her, she a busybody Baby, if you want me, can't be turning up with everybody Nah, can't be fucking on this city Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. So today is a starting, well today is the starting of a new vlog. Um, I'm going out tonight, I'm going to be doing my nails just now. However, my nails start the full process and my hair, because I did do my hair and my lashes like in the week. Um, my hair and my lashes, well, I didn't get to record the lashes to be honest, so... It will not be in the vlog, but I will make sure that the hair, of course, and my nails is in the, are, my hair and my nails are in the maintenance vlog. So this vlog is separate from the maintenance vlog. The maintenance vlog is the vlog that will show you guys how I did my hair and my nails pretty much like the process. Um, this vlog is about me doing things, like other things apart from my hair and my nails oh my gosh i don't know if because i'm going to go do my nails is like my is that my nails know that i'm going to do it today so it starts like excuse me no <laughs> so i have my nail appointment at 12 30 and oh my gosh i did my hair last night and it's so cute like it's just a jet black most on middle part i don't know if i want to take off the headband i'm probably going to take it out to give my hair a little breather Ooh. 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 okay okay this hair gave me a facelift <laughs> literally literally gave me a facelift I'm going to be styling my hair later on, um, but for now, um, I just did like the basics, so I just installed it and I left it because I'm like, later on, I'll definitely um, style it. But yeah, I have my nails at 12 and then ooh, I'm going out later on. This is pretty much my Valentine's Day dinner. <laughs> Just so you guys know. Like, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to first of all save some battery space because I don't know how come I did not plug in my extra batteries last night, like the replacement batteries. I don't know how many did last night. And this one is almost like it's halfway through and I don't understand why. Because it was supposed to be charged. But I guess it's not charged, so yeah. I'm just gonna finish getting ready and then ooh, probably see you guys when my nails are done for this vlog. Again, if you guys wanna see how I got my nails done and the um, well, you guys are gonna see the result, but if you wanna see the process, then you have to watch my maintenance vlog. But yeah, I'm gonna go. So, guys, I'm just leaving my nail appointment i'm going to the mall because i want to see if i can find some earrings from zara i don't know if they have it but i'm going to try um these are my nails by the way super cute uh if you guys want to see the process of me getting them done then you have to watch the next vlog but for now i'm going to the mall i mean i haven't been to stc in like years <laughs> literally so I don't even remember how the mall is. <sighs> but yeah. Since I was already close by, I'm not like, definitely just come to this one. But anyways, yeah, we're at the mall. Oh my gosh, I haven't been in the bay for years now. First of all, I haven't been in this mall for years. Let's start from there. My lips are... Mm -mm. 
No way. Okay, let's go, cuz. I know who I am, and I'm not drifting, okay? I'm keeping my head straight. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, baby. This dress is sexy. It is. It's grown. It gives like a grown vibe. No? No? Am I the only one that thinks so? So I'm currently home and I'm about to go take a shower to start getting ready for later. The dinner is at 9. I don't know why I thought it was at 10, but it's at 9. But I just wanted to quickly show you guys what I ended up getting. So basically, they were um, like the little stands that were there because it's Black History Month. Uh, some small black owned companies were there and you could purchase from them like right there yeah, yeah, yeah so i ended up purchasing these earrings that i'm going to wear tonight these beautiful earrings like yeah i think they're very unique so um i had to get them because the other ones i wanted to support by the way because it's black history month and i'm just like i went to the mall to buy earrings anyways so why not get something from a black owned company um yeah so this is the package that it came in it's super cute and i don't know if you guys want to purchase something from them but this is a coupon code you can screenshot it i'm not gonna screenshot it uh like you can screenshot it and then you use it and then i also got <clears throat> i don't have silver jewelry and i'm like okay if i'm going out then i can wear this and it looks more sleek and it wasn't expensive either. This was $55 Canadian. So it's just a silver bracelet. I don't have any um, silver jewelry. So I needed it, like I said. And she actually gave me this bracelet for free. It's cute, I like it. So I have some silver pieces that I can actually wear. That looks elegant, because I love when my jewelry, I love when they're elegant pieces. So yeah, anyways, I'm gonna go take a shower right now. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna let my camera charge for a bit. I'm gonna go take a shower and come back and do my makeup. I'm not gonna do my makeup on camera. Probably the next time you guys see me, I'll be ready to um go. So yeah. Okay guys, so we are on our way. We are late as usual, courtesy of Tavani. Wow, she's because always blaming me. She takes forever to get ready. <laughs> um, 
Wow. Also, you know she's self affected right now. Just know that. <laughs> also, we don't have any gas at this time. <laughs> and it's now 9.48. The dinner uh, reservation is for 10. Um, You're going to call them at 10 to say we're going to be five minutes late. It's 20 minutes drive, so that's okay. pretty good. But the gas part is going to take some time. So we're going to see him. We're gonna see him. Guys, we made it, but we're late. Good. <laughs> you see, even me, I'm here, there. Eh? Heard it? The doorman guy there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's just parking the car for us. <laughs> oh my gosh, I couldn't even show you guys what I wore because we were rushing. So I have to show you guys I couldn't get inside. But it's cute. And the earrings though. The earrings really go. Like it goes. It did. It's giving. Or whatnot. So to reiterate, this menu is a choice for which you'll be indulging in this menu. Now a little bit more so what we're known for is that we take in a binder here. This is our tasting menu, going to showcase our signature dishes that we have at Don Alonzo. Even based off our original location, which is in Italy, off the Amalfi Coast. Speaking of the Amalfi Coast, they will take advantage of the Mediterranean Sea that has to offer there for them. So it is a bit more seafood oriented because of its portions there. Six of these courses are savory, two of them are dolce dessert. And if you would like, we offer two wine pairings, a classic and a premium, at two and a half ounces per course and seven pairs. guys i'm gonna come back so it is a couple days after the um the dinner with tavani that i went to like the valentine's day dinner it is roughly like a week after to be honest 
um i have an event that i'm going on wednesday it is pretty much like a networking event that i was um i got invitation to and i need something to wear and i have nothing i've been searching for something online for the past the entire week it's been stressing me out because if you know me when i have somewhere to go i like planning my outfits like in advance and i've been sitting down just browsing the internet like what do i wear what do i wear and i was gonna get a next dress from c house of cb but i was just like sis no i really hate getting dresses every single time i'm going somewhere just because i feel like there's no effort put in it you know like a dress is very easy like you could just get a dress find a shoes bag and then that's it i don't really like dressing easy i like dressing and when people see me or when i look at myself i can say yeah there's some thought process that was put into this outfit you know i like that so i like either going with like a top on the bottom or like you know i like going out of the box type of thing i feel like i just is too easy so just like no more dress for this week no i'm lying maybe one more dress but i need an outfit like an outfit so i'm gonna go to the mall i saw some things i was at the mall when was that the mall saturday and i was looking on a few things i didn't get any i was just browsing pretty much because i wasn't there to shop um and i saw a few things in zara and aritzia so i'm gonna check aritzia first because i feel like i'm going to zara i'm gonna check aritzia first and see what they have hopefully i can find something um i really hope i can find something but yeah i really hate shopping at the mall by the way i like going to the mall for like maybe shoes or bags but like for clothing i just feel like it's just a waste of time because you can never find anything but hopefully i do okay so i'm gonna head on out right now sam's gonna be home you're gonna be sad he's gonna be so sad he's gonna be home by himself for a little while but i'm not gonna take long I'm gonna take back. anyways guys let's go <laughs> Oh my gosh, guys. So, <laughs> first of all, this is an extra small, but I still wanted to see how it would look with these pants on. These pants are a little bit big. I wanted it to be more like down here, but they're big. So I have to get a smaller one in this and I have to get like a small or like a medium in this. This is extra small, so it's like really squeezing me in. Um, but I think, I, I think I'm getting somewhere with this. I don't know. This is very random. Rolling on the Las Vegas trip tonight Slip that on and we might miss the fight Fuck a night, I keep the quality in my shorty bag You know she wanna mind when she tattooed that ass I'm a lover boy, she got a choice She been coming in a rider This that roll myself a take Hey guys, I'm welcome back, so Today is the next day I went to the mall yesterday and it was very, very hectic. Like, very. I was stressing out. I couldn't find anything to wear. And this is why I don't normally go to the mall to get stuff. I normally just order something online because it's way easier. Um, but yeah, yesterday was just very chaotic. And then I still ended up getting something. I don't know if I really like it. Like, 100%. But I I'm just going to have to work with it right now. And... I, then when i was leaving the mall and i was driving out tell me why this girl hit in the back of the car and it was just just a whole lot happening because she hit in the back of the car and then she kind of was pretending like it wasn't her fault and then she was younger so i guess she had to call her parents because i was like okay let's just exchange information and then the insurance will like deal with all of that and she had to call her parents to say like, can she give me her insurance or can she give me like her information or whatever? I don't know, but her parents end up coming and then they weren't there, but they're gonna come and say, their daughter is a good driver, so 
she didn't do it like type of thing it was just too much happening and i was just like you know what i'm just so annoyed like when i got home i was cold frustrated my head was hurting me i just came home and I just went to sleep because i was like i'm not like i can't okay so today is the following day and today is the day when i have the event with l'oreal paris it is for 6 30 today i want to change my wig so i'm gonna do that like just now i also have a wig to bleach yes i have a wig to bleach and i want to change my wig um okay sumps okay so that's what i'm about to do right now and then later on when i see you guys i'll probably be ready because I'm not really going to be vlogging throughout the day because there's nothing really that I'm doing than just getting ready for later. So yeah. Also did my lashes again. Well, I just refilled this one because this one was like falling out. Sums. So yeah, I basically just refilled my lashes. And yeah, I'm going to see you guys later on when I'm getting ready. Or when I'm done getting ready. My lashes are about to die, so. Okay guys, so remember yesterday... I ended up going to the mall and I did get something but for some reason I don't like it well I'm not gonna say I don't like it I like it but I don't think it's for this occasion okay so basically I kind of saw a snippet of what will be happening and I was just like okay I don't think I'm gonna wear that outfit um and also I couldn't figure out what shoes to wear with it so just like you know what let me not do it and I also have a next event next week Tuesday going which is a Black History Month event and I feel like that I could wear that outfit to that event so I was just like okay let me just try to find something quickly to wear um so I ended up just wearing these shorts I had them for a while and they're a little bit big but I got them taken in um so it's good right now and I had this white top which I was just like, okay, let me just do full way. Um, but it is cold outside, so I'm going to be doing this blazer over it. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, so I'll be doing this blazer. So this way, and then the blazer, I'm gonna fold the blazer though. So it looks more, it gets clean or whatever, I don't know. Fold it like, I don't know if I should just fold it or should I do it? I think I'm gonna do it like that. So I'm gonna pull it up and leave it like so. Okay, so this is what it's giving right now. Because the thing is, I'm going to like a skin, it's, I think we're doing like a skin cure lab type of thing. I don't know. I think it's something like that. Um, but anyways, I feel like this is what I'm going to be wearing. And then I have these Valentinos that I haven't worn as yet. Well, I'm lying. But yeah, I haven't worn them like in a long time. So I'm going to wear these. I'm going to give it like a little color to it. And then I had this bag, which I got this. My mom got me this bag when I came to Canada, okay? From 2015. I never wore it. And I was just like, since I'm wearing the Valentino, it has the pop of blue. I was just like, okay. So this is the outfit, pretty much. So this is what I'll be wearing, my Valentinos and this cute bag. Um, and I think this is it. I'm not doing anything else to be honest. I'm not trying to pressure myself. This is what I'm wearing. Anyways, normally I, I'd get a ride from Tav because Tav was supposed to come, but she's not going to get to come. So I'm on my own today. So I'm going to go call my Uber and I'll see you guys when I'm at the event. So. <laughs> Still short. No, not the height. Yeah. 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 Shorty. Sure.
skin. So you can see very lightweight. It goes in and I can feel it on the bottom. It goes all the way through because of the molecular weight of the hyaluronic acid. So this is the next day after the L'Oreal Paris event. Um, I'm going on the road right now because I don't... Did I tell you guys? That? So when I went to the mall to get my outfit for the event yesterday, um, when I, w I was parked and then I was leaving and I'm reversing and the girl turned into me and she hit the back of the car. So, now we're going to the collision center to report it and to get that sorted out. Got the insurance, but I took the picture and the picture, of course, did not take properly. It's very blurry, but I do remember the license plate and I have their phone number and I also have the guy's phone number. So, yeah. So, we're about to go to the place right now to sort that out. So, I'll keep you guys updated on what's happening. Okay. So guys, I forgot to bring you guys inside, but we're basically done at the collision center. Um, we just made the report and then we're gonna have to call the insurance when they're home. And then I think that's it. But, yeah. What? This point. Yeah, we want a reality show, but we'd have to record every single thing. Yeah, we're the bad and the good. The other, the end? When we are close. Because, yeah, everything. Be a drama. No. Well. Be a bad word. As we never know, it's the flag accompanying journey. Yeah, but I just didn't bring it inside because I wasn't sure and I don't want, you know. But yeah. Anyway, so I'll see TV out here, you know. I let my ask staff for make report. Oh, what happened, ma'am? You had an accident? <laughs> I'm like, uh, yeah. Oh, what happened? I'm like, I, I wasn't there. Were, were, were you in the driver? Were you in a car? I'm like, <laughs> oh, okay. Have a good day. <laughs> Anyways, we're heading back home now. So, I'll see you guys. When I'm away. So, hey guys. So, this is like a couple days after. I don't even remember what happened in the last clips. Because it's been a couple days since I, I've taken up my camera for vlogging. Um, But I am on my way to a Black History Month event. It is for influencers, I think. Um, it is downtown. It starts at 7. <laughs> okay, it starts at 7. It's not 7.22. So, 
I had to go but I was doing videos I was like I was just doing too much right now and yeah anyways let me go and I'm gonna put my shoes on put some perfume on and then I'm gonna go because I need to leave like ASAP like no this does not look good but anyways yeah let's go I really, really hate rushing but I kind of want to quickly show you guys what I'm wearing anyways um oh yeah you guys probably see so it is the top that I bought from Zara and then these pants feels more like a cargo type of um, material and then my dear heels oh my gosh and then I'm just gonna be wearing it with this so giving all neutral type of vibes anyways my late so I'm off to leave now so I'll see you guys when I'm at the event Mwah. more for the exact same collaboration. Sorry, 20,000 pounds. So, <laughs> in Canadian, that's 40,000. Yeah. So, um, so this is a, this is an issue that has been emerging, especially be, and becoming extraordinarily apparent during the pandemic era. Um, have you ever experienced this? So, personally, I haven't, but I do know what happens. And my thoughts on this is I feel like we have that power, especially everyone in this room, to be open and transparent with each other. And it's basically not the influencers versus the brands, but we do have to stand together and show that show the brands that we are we have value. And I think building this community and everyone here, it's good to, to have that.
guys so i basically just got home i'm super super tired um but i'm gonna end off this vlog because i feel like it's been drawn out long enough i was trying to like get some substance before actually ending the vlog and i think i got enough substance and i think it was a good way to finish off this black history month i enjoyed every single part of this event like literally it was giving what it was supposed to give like i don't know let me put you guys down here i just feel like okay wait 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 so yeah, i just feel like it actually i don't know this event literally gave and i feel like it did what it was supposed to do um the fact that there were so many black creators there i was super super happy and i was like oh my god get to me some of my supporters and i was super happy like so many people came up to me i was like oh my gosh are you the girl from tiktok and i'm like yeah it's me <laughs> um i don't know like for a second i'm starstruck by them because it's like oh no no me like me <laughs> me you sure you know me, <laughs> you, you sure me? <laughs> uh, but i really really had a lot of fun and i'm happy i went for sure um but yeah monique actually did great like she did a fantastic job i'm literally living for it oh my gosh i think i should show you guys what i got inside the, the, the oh the thing so this is a goodie bag that we got i didn't even open it so let's see if i brought that for tab um my top you know I, I wish i had gotten the smaller one but it's okay it kept falling off when i was in when i was at the event i hated that but fine. okay okay so i got some Dr. Teal's Relax and Relief. Oh, I got the body wash and the Epsom salt. Per, per. Um, what else? Oh, I got a little note card. I'm gonna open that last. What else? What is this? Oh, I got some Mac lip thingy. Um, I got a next face wash okay i said the next deck i got more i got a lotion this is a mini lotion so cute i got a primer oh my gosh these this is why i live for these events because i get free stuff i got a cleanser like a mini i don't remember how that thing is but i think it's serve i don't remember but anyways and i got some clean goodness oh my gosh guys you know i actually wanted this it's the clinique uh cleansing balm and you can use it to take your makeup off i'm super happy i'm so happy i got it and advanced night repair i don't know what this is but yeah and then i got this card let's see what the card says so right here it says thank you so i think it's pretty much just a thank you card but let's open it together See what it says. Let's see. Oh, thank you for coming. Don't stop believing. You have so much to give the world. Keep going. Oh, that is so cute. Oh my gosh. Anyway, that is it, guys. That is all I got inside my um my little goodie bag this is the end of this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed this one. Oh my gosh i need to do my lashes but my lash appointment is tomorrow but it's fine anyways thank you guys for watching and i will definitely see you guys in my next one i think i'm gonna get this as well